R.I.P. Let's play Deus Ex. Or as I like to call it, the Alexander Brandon concert, because his work on this game is freaking amazing. Um, uh... Ah, screw it, that's too hard. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm... That... Uh, lock picking probably. Electronics. I got you. That'll work. Your appointment to FEMA should be finalized within the week. I've already discussed the matter with the Senator. I take it he was agreeable? He didn't really have a choice. Has he been infected? Oh yes, most certainly. When I mentioned that we could put him on the priority list for the Ambrosia vaccine, he was so willing it was almost pathetic. This play, the rioting is intensifying to the point where we may not be able to contain it. Why contain it? Let it spill over into the schools and churches. Let the bodies pile up in the streets. In the end, they'll beg us to save them. I've received reports of armed attacks on shipments. There's not enough vaccine to go around, and the underclasses are starting to get desperate. Of course they're desperate. They can smell their death, and the sound they'll make rattling their cage will serve as a warning to the rest. Hmm. I mm. hope you're not underestimating the problem. The others may not go as quietly as you think. Intelligence indicates they're behind the problems in Paris. A bunch of pretentious old men playing at running the world. But the world left them behind long ago. We are the future. We have other problems. UNATCO? Formed by executive order after the terrorist strike on the statue. I have someone in place, though. I'm more concerned about Savage. He's relocated to Vandenberg. Our biochem corpus is far in advance of theirs, as is our electronic sentience. And their ethical inflexibility has allowed us to make progress in areas they refuse to consider. The Augmentation Project? Among other things, but I must admit that I have been somewhat disappointed in the performance of the primary unit. The secondary unit should be online soon. It's currently undergoing preparation and will be operational within six months. My people will continue to report on its progress. Necessary, the primary will be terminated. We've had to endure much, you and I, but soon there will be order again. A new age. Aquinas spoke of the mythical city on the hill. Soon that city will be a reality, and we will be crowned its kings. Not better than kings. Gods. Gods. Liberty Island. Let me just say real quick, it's... It kind of amazes me how many games I've played in the past year that have to do with some sort of plague. I just kind of realize that it's a little strange. Anyway, here we are, Liberty Island, statue blown up. What's what's this guy up to? My orders are to stay here. Mm hmm. What's up, JC? Your brother Paul is on his way to meet you at the dock. The NSF is raiding the island and shots have been fired. I repeat, find Paul. I will monitor your situation from HQ. I don't think I actually have to find Paul. I think he finds me. Let me just get them binox. Oh, yep, there he is. I thought you were in Hong Kong. Welcome to the coalition, JC. I might as well start using your code name. Think I'd miss my brother's first day? Didn't think you'd have a choice. Sweet guy. What's going on? The NSF. They hit one of our shipments. A few of them got away, but we trapped the rest in the statue. What are we waiting for? Looks like a textbook assault. The NSF took one of our agents hostage. 
The bots are holding the perimeter, but my orders are to hold back and send you in alone. I think someone high up wants to see how you handle the situation. All I've got with me is a pistol and an electric prod. I don't mind a test, but Unaco better issue some hardware. <laughs> Remember that we're police. Stick with the prod. It'll stun your opponents or knock them unconscious. A non-lethal takedown is always the most silent way to eliminate resistance. Just in case, though, Manderly wants you to pick an additional weapon. A sniper rifle, a gep gun, or a mini crossbow. Let me get that, uh, mini crossbow. The crossbow. Sometimes you've got to make a silent takedown. Good thinking. With these tranquilizer darts, you'll have another non-lethal way to take down an enemy in addition to the prod. I get the idea. What's the first move? I'm going to give you a map of the island. If you can get to the north dock, a Unatco informant will give you a key to the statue doors. He responds to the code phrase, iron and copper. You could avoid a lot of fighting, though, if you found a back way to the statue. I'll see how it looks on shore. Your primary objective is the makeshift command center the terrorists have installed at the top of the statue. But don't forget about Agent Harriman. We think he's being held on the ground floor. What are my orders when I reach the command center? Interrogate the leader. We don't yet know why the terrorists would risk an open assault. Good point. Later, Paul. Appreciate you, bro. I, uh, always tend to go for, like, the stealthy, like, pacifist type, uh, play styles for Deus Ex. Sweet. What is that? Bioelectric cell. There's been several... Oh, over here. Several years since I've played this game. Actually, what's my save buttons? Ooh, I better check that. Quick save is plus. Weird. Ah. That's some Unreal Tournament engine weirdness for you. What's up, Paul? I did a lot of stuff while you were very uh, leisurely SF walking back this way. Your orders are to shoot on sight. A UNATCO informant on the North Dock can get you inside the statue. Look for a bomb. Identify yourself with the phrase, iron and copper. If you want to make a covert approach, remember the Academy stealth course. Stay out of their field of view, walk slowly to stay quiet, and crouch behind cover. Or if you have to get your hands dirty, remember that a headshot is a lethal takedown. We're not going for lethal takedowns here, Alex. Thanks, though. Only if I have to. I will take all of these fools out, though. I probably uh, should have put more skill pointage in uh, weapons. <laughs> Actually, you know what? No. Screw that. Let me... No! Uh, crap. Need that baton. I got his attention though, didn't I? Could go that way. Let's go this way.
give these guys a wide berth here. Stick to them shadow. There's that underground thing. trail of blood. The uh, baton did not uh, do as I expected it to do. Who is that? I didn't see a uniform. cleanest, but, uh, you know. I like that ladder that goes nowhere. Yield 30 points. I probably should have, uh, directed that somewhere. Coughing nails. When you've just got to have a cigarette. Who's This power box must have been damaged in the raid. Don't cross through the arcs. I'm also picking up an EMP field here. If you're not careful, it'll suck away your bioelectrical energy. Hmm. Brother. I've set up the turrets and cameras on the statue ruins, a hasty defense, but since we won't be here long, it should work. The security login is NSF001. The password is smash the state. was my that was my suit nice I wasted some stuff there weapon modification clip laser can I attach the laser to as well. some of the security by entering this way. Ooh. 
Oops. Daggone it. I have no idea how that happened. Okay, sweet. <clears throat> You maniacs. You blew it up. attention though, didn't it? Good. You're nearing the command center. Agent Herman remains in captivity on the ground floor, but we can probably get him out. Keep moving. Oh, that's right. Well, now I'm wondering. I feel like... I feel like I should go get Herman. I feel like that's XP lost. Can I find the shipment? Yeah, we got the whole supply. You can see the ship's lights crossing the bay. Guess y'all were right. So why aren't we pulling out? Mike's on the horn. Jojo wants a lead on the distribution network. Jojo? Yeah, we don't have enough men to protect what we've got. That's what Jojo wants. Do I have an objectives thing? Let me look here. Ghouls. Uh, the NSC is to get inside and locate the threat. Meet UNAC co informant Harley Philbin at the North Docks. He has a key to the statue doors. One of UNACO's top agents will be held inside the statue. Break him out and he'll back you up against the NSF. Maybe never mind then. I like Herman, but I'm not trying to have a shootout. See, 
The NSF targeted a shipment of the plague vaccine Ambrosia. We can't locate it. See if the leader will surrender when you reach the command post. We'd like to interrogate him. With pleasure. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> Let's get out of here. I'm standing my thought I saw some oh. ah. this one's a goner. Well then. Getting things done. <laughs> Let's get out of here. I'm standing my ground. Uh, I can just slip past these guys. Ooh, a candy bar. Don't mind if I do. Easy. We want you to take this one alive like and kid, conscious. Out Find balls. out what you can about the shipment, then turn him over to one of the troopers. Nice. Hey, pal. Don't shoot. I surrender. So yeah, you, think you, you do. know better than FEMA what to do with this month's Ambrosia shipment? You're too late. It's on its way back to the people, and you can't do a damn thing about it. <laughs> Tell me about the shipment, and I'll order the troops to pick you up as a prisoner instead of a corpse. Ask away. We already won this round. Where are you taking it? We're just giving ordinary people the same chance to survive as the bureaucrats in Washington. You'll have to unload New York because the choppers would spot you at sea. I think the government made the plague on purpose to get rid of the population growth. Well done. I will pass on your orders to the troopers. Report back to base on the west side of the island. Mission complete. Kill him. Just answer the question. Don't believe me? It's all in the numbers. For a hundred years, there's been a conspiracy of plutocrats against ordinary people. Do you have a single fact to back that up? Number one, in 1945, corporations paid 50% of the Do you have a single issue satisfact to snack that up? 5%. Number two, in 1900, 90% of Americans were self-employed. Now it's about 2%. So? It's called consolidation. Strengthen governments and corporations, weaken individuals. With taxes, this can be done imperceptibly over time. Yeah. I guarantee you that the interrogation staff at UNACO will not be as forbearing as I am. Yeah, the secret police. You're just bullies for a completely illegitimate government in Washington. We will locate that shipment one way or another. The entire executive branch is hand-picked. 19 of the last 23 U.S. presidents have been members of the Trilateral Commission. The Trilateral Commission is financed by the Rockefellers and the Rothschilds. Don't tell me. That's a think tank. Anyone can become a member. But not everyone does. That's why they call it the secret government. You can't fight ideas with bullets. True. The chief finally let us loose. We were right behind you and cut through them like a hot knife through butter. I only knocked like a couple of them out, dude. But, oh, no, never mind. I was going to say at least I can loot the corpses. What is a PS20? I don't think they would have reached PS20 by the 2050s. Special plasma-based weapon developed by an unknown security organization as a next-generation next stealth pistol. Unfortunately, the necessity of maintaining a small physical profile restricts the weapon to a single shot. Despite its limited functionality, the PS20 can be lethal at close range. I probably won't be making use of that. But at least I have it. Okay. Well, at least now I can go explore the complex. Before heading back to base. Since the gang's all here. You guys? 
Ooh, let's hack it. Withdraw that. Sweet. Cash on hand. Slipped out on his own. Report back to base. Good for him. Hunter's a good dude. Ooh, accuracy. Don't need that. They killed everybody. It does kind of make me feel like I probably should have, uh... Gone ahead and... Knocked everybody out. Yo. Yo. Little drunk. That's no ordinary JC. Wait, I should be able to bash the door open. Nope. If it was a wooden door, maybe. deeper in. So many people use that ATM each day that it's busted 90% of the time, but if it's working, you might need some cash today for the pub crawl we've got planned in the city. Don't let the tourists get you down. See you there tonight, sweetie. Jonathan, your husband to be. Yes, I was serious last night. I really want to get married in the statue. Met there on duty and all our friends work there. Aw. Ah, what's the other side of that thing? Sent us in to pick up the pieces. We've already searched the bodies and delivered the enemy munitions to the quartermaster. Yeah, I'm sure you did. Took all my loot, is what you did. Cigarettes killed me. I was just trying to get them out of my inventory.
feel like this is it over here. Yeah, there's a helicopter. Hey, Paul. We've got the island secured. How did things look in the statue? The leader surrendered. So they were after Ambrosia. A month's supply for the east coast. We think they've taken it back to the city. I didn't know Unaco handled the Ambrosia distribution. Manderly will brief us shortly. Unaco makes sure the limited supply of vaccine gets to government agencies and key industries. It's good to finally see some action. Just keep a level head. You're doing well so far. Now get inside. I'll meet you in Manderly's office, level two. It's really crazy that the NSF would stage... But you went a little soft on the NSF. The guys had to mop up for you. I used necessary force. Well, necessary force won't work when we chase these sons of bitches into the city. You better load up on some hardware. I scored an extra scope from a couple of thugs we dropped down by the dock. You can have it for 700 credits. I also picked up some 10 millimeter ammo and some crossbow darts. Say 200 for one and 60 for the other. Shouldn't you turn that stuff over to the quartermaster? You should. Carter? He don't care. NSF goods are the spoils of war. We're risking our lives out here. I'll check back with you later. We're getting making a profit off of uh, my loot drops. If I remember right, there's a hatch or something over here. Yeah. Can I do that without getting spotted? What's this? Nano key. Unaco compound hatch. Nice. Let's see. Get out of sight of the camera. Let's see if I can hack this thing real quick. I'm pretty sure that this is like nothing. Secret wall door. I think this is like the security. This is not necessarily something that I need to. Well, I did that. Attention night shift. Van camera system login. This is we will beat you at docks, sucker. Another EMP grenade. Or I think that's my first one, actually. Just closes the hatch. What is this? Oh well, at least I got some XP for going down in there. Way to go, sir. Thank you. Your pal over there didn't seem too pleased with my performance. Get inside. I'll meet you in Manderley's office. I hear you just slipped by a lot of the terrorists. Pretty smart. Thanks. I mean, it's just disappearing again, so we're changing the door code. For it's my first day, too. I'm pretty excited. 0451. Mm. I was in your class at the academy. You probably don't remember. I don't. Sorry, I'm not very good with people's names and faces. On level two. Dang, I'm looking good. Come on in. 
The retinal scanner can read blood vessel patterns right through your sunglasses. <laughs> right through my sunglasses. Nice. Thanks, bro. I heard there was a lot of fighting topside. Not really. Or I guess there was after I completed Remember the main objective. Remember that Mr. Manderly wants to see you. Level 2. His secretary, Janice Reed, has your login and password. Hell of a first day. Telling me, bro. You found your office. Did Janice give you your login? I guess not. Let's see. JCD password Bionic Man. Bionic Man. JCD Bionic Man. Checking the emails. Hey JC, guess I'll have to get used to calling you JC around the office. Not sure where they came up with that, but at least they gave you the same last code name as your brother. Anyways, whatever they're calling you, it's good to see a familiar name on the roster. First job here has been to read up on your augmentations. I'm beginning to see why you found classes so easy. Every neuron in your head has been augmented. For example, the voice in your head from an operator, someone here at HQ, able to handle scanning equipment in your skull and broadcast advice over the info link, le leaps fully formed right into your temporal lobe, bypassing the eardrum and its sensory neuron, and it's perfectly inaudible to everyone around you, of course. Not to mention that the nanites clinging to your accents can both receive and transmit symbolic information. So if you ever need help, don't sweat it. Someone at HQ probably already knows. Bye if you want to hear more. This is great stuff. Hi me. Yeah, Reyes, Dr. Reyes. I was asked by the regional medical coordinator to forward this information to all of you. I do so without further comment. By now you've heard that the upcoming transition to nano augmentation is coming, but it's not as soon as you think. Unico has only one nano augmented agent, with the second just now graduating from the academy, and that'd be Paul and JC. It will be years before the program leaves the laboratory. Your mechanical augmentations are not obsolete. Some agents express concern that they will be walking junk in 10 years. <laughs> One agent expressed their fears in an anonymous email saying, We'll be sold at flea markets. Old gray golems for scaring the children. So what about my legs? What about my life? Keep some perspective. Prosthetics remain the only proven technology for enhancing human ability. Those who make the sacrifice are appreciated, committed, and saluted as heroes. Nano augmented agents will often encounter stress created by resentment among fellow agents, particularly those who have been mechanically augmented. In an, offer, in an effort to secure freedom and liberty for those under the protection, many UNACO agents have chosen to sacrifice social acceptance for mission performance by surgically replacing limbs and organs with mechanically or electronically enhanced equivalents. Your nano augmentations point that way to the future. Thousands of microscopic living organic machines that exist in symbiosis with your body. Because such augmentations create only minimal disfigurement, minimal, they are likely to be a source of friction between you and other mechanically augmented agents, but it is important to understand that UNITCO is an organization where individuals must act in concert. Each is important to the whole, and mutual understanding is essential to teams comprised of diverse human and augmented agents. If you have any further questions or wish to discuss these issues, please feel free to send an, send an email to Carver Eschels Unatco blah 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 to make an appointment. And welcome to Unatco, Agent. It's friendly folks. I'm not gonna read everything. Just most things. Your partner for the next assignment, Anna Navarra, is in the adjoining break room to the east. Maybe you should introduce yourself. Maybe. Oh, sweet pinball. Hey. Are you sure you pressed the right button? I do not make mistakes of that kind. Your hand might have slipped. No, I wanted orange. It gave me lemon lime. The machine would not make a mistake. It's the maintenance man. He knows I like orange. <laughs> so you think the staff has some kind of plot? Yes, they do that on purpose. 
Egg my new time. partner, J.C. Denton. Don't tell me you're going to wear those sunglasses during a night operation. Baby, when you're this cool, the sun's Better always shining. Better to help the distractions of another agent who needs backup. Forgive my interruption. I just wanted to say that I look forward to working with you, Agent Navarra. Also, excuse me, I've got to be briefed by Mr. Manderley. I do not expect you to perform as well as Agent Herman, but the mission will require us to do more than frighten the NSF with our baggy coats that make us look bigger than we really are. I am prepared to perform my duties. For instance, not to wipe out the enemy and then leave Agent still captured in a locked cell. No problem. Oops. Sorry, Gunter. Get your checkup on level 3, and let's get going. So let me get a candy bear. Candy bar sustained me. President Philip Mead. I have to prepare for the mission. Okay, get out of the dang way. Kindly. Miss Anna Navarra. Manderley's office. Hey, Denise. I'm just gonna take this. Good work out there, Mr. Denton. Mr. Manderley said you handled yourself nicely. Welcome to UNATCO HQ. Our little family keeps getting bigger. Is Mr. Manderley available? Yes, go right in. By the way, your computer account is ready. Log in JCD, password Bionic Man. Alex already told me. Thanks. He's waiting, JC. Oh, yeah, sorry. Let me just hey, check I'm this. Trying to work. Sorry. Just FYI, your new password is Nightkiller. I know you led the mission to Paris against that old terrorist organization or whatever it was. Your login is still Jay Manderley. Ah. I know Joseph's login stuff. Reporting for duty. Hey, director. The man himself. Splendid. Do you accept my apologies about the situation topside? A refreshing change from the academy, sir. Don't despise training, my boy. Even you would be worthless without the shaping touch of drills and studies. So the NSF took a shipment of the Ambrosia vaccine? Give me a chopper and a pilot and I'll handle it. <laughs> I'm sure you could. Yes, indeed. But we're having your brother head up the recovery team. You'll work with Agent Anna Navarra. Why don't we meet when you've seen Jaime for a medical checkup and received your equipment from Sam Carter? You'll be briefed at that time. Yes, sir. Nice. Uh, feel free to leave your office. Snag that real quick. <sighs> Mouse droid. That was a close one up there. Yeah, telling me. Use the turtle real quick. Uh, much better. Somebody's been smoking in the bathroom, boys. Can't be doing that now. Let me wash my hands. I'm a res. They're doing medical asparagus on the terrorists. You look like the real thing. They actually let you operate on people. <laughs> Just fixed Gunther's knee, in fact. A sticky actuator. So far, I feel more like a mechanic than a doctor. I'm impressed. They actually let you point a gun at people. We'll have to catch up later. I've got to leave for New York right away. Could you send Manderley whatever it is he wants? No problem. Listen, JC, about your augmentations. You know they're preparing to roll out the technology worldwide, right? As long as I don't turn green and grow a pair of antennas, as I understand it. Yeah, well, the design's pretty modular, which means you'll soon have access to upgrades from standard augmentation canisters. I think I picked one of those up at the top of the statue. Maybe you did. My order from Versalife was on the ship the NSF oh, captured. Life. You'll need to take it to one of the medbots for installation. I'll do that. Good to know they're the still around. The canisters contain a colloid of ROM modules. Some are generic upgrades, others require you to make permanent choices about how to configure one of your subsystems. It's about time they implemented some of this stuff. 
Seriously. One more thing before I go, since you've been briefed on my augmentations. What can you tell me about the info link? Let's see. Micro receiver exostructure in the sulci, mechanocarbon threads on the axons. For queuing, you know, packet routing. Anything particularly interest you? Is there a way to turn it off? Mm -hmm. The info link? Yeah, or is someone at UNACO tuned in 24 hours? These might sound a little funny, JC, but I'm not permitted to answer that question. Well, your clearance is higher than mine. Regarding your systems, I am your physician. No big deal. I was just curious. Help. What is this thing? Heal all. Combat strength, microfiber muscles. That's where you can th throw stuff. Yeah, I don't really need combat strength. Muscle strength is amplified with ionic polymeric gel myofibrils that allow the agent to push and lift extraordinarily heavy objects. Yeah, let me go ahead and get that one. Thank you kindly, Medbot. Janine's bots. Monster Gravis GV4 Nightingale Medical Bot. The Monster Gravis G4 is the newest addition to the MG line. Their first foray into the medical bot category, largely monopolized by Page Industries and Chung subsidiary Healtech. Unlike the competing Pager Healtech units, the MG GV4 benefits from completely pro proprietary proprietary operating systems developed at MG's research campus in Prague. It promises to revolutionize automated healing by combining a comprehensive medical and pharmaceutical database with MG's already proven autonomous heuristic routines. While actual field data is sketchy at this point in time, anecdotal evidence suggests that the GV4 can heal wounds far beyond the capabilities of any other competing model, though it does require a substantial recharging period. I don't think that there is any particular benefit to like reading everything in this one. I don't think that that became a Hey Alex's office. You're getting warm. <laughs> You're red hot. Looks like you found me. Change GM and password to Zag guys next week. It'll be Food. Strange guy. E Voice in my head. <laughs> like leading a mouse to cheese. This thing is starting to give me a headache. Don't worry. We shut it down when you go off duty. I guess I'll get used to it. I'm Alex Jacobson, communications engineer. I suppose you already know who I am. This is your Getting office. There, you're certainly quicker on the uptake than your brother Paul ever was. Thanks. Don't worry, I'll be watching your back. Munition is disappearing again, blah blah blah. Yeah. 0451. Ah. Whoops. That's not it. There's a secret passage in or from his office, isn't there? Ah, I'm out of multi tools. It's not zero four five one. One three seven. Nope. Candy bar. Ooh. I'll hack. I'll hack some computers when nobody's looking. See if I can find the code to that door. Mm hmm. Skull gun. I personally, blah, blah, blah. Ooh. Doesn't do the thing where... I don't remember if it does the thing where it... I don't 
have enough points to upgrade again yet. There's something important in there, I knew it. I just know it. I'll see if Alex's name is on this list. Yes. Two thousand one. for some reason. Don't you worry about what I'm doing in here, Alex. Lockpick. By electric cell. There's not even anything super cool in here. I could have swore there was like a... Like a vent or something that leaded to and from his office. It'll be interesting to see how the transmission sounds. Uh huh. This is the agent's offices. I am not going to hold your hand. You have your orders. Yes, ma'am. Way to go, sir. Thanks, bro. Gunther should have followed orders. What did he do? NSF guy. Open the doors. I'd like to speak with the prisoner, please. See Manderley on level two and let's move out. Hey, Carter. At ease, Agent Denton. General Carter, I read about the Merced operation in school. This is a great honor. <laughs> I'm not a general anymore. Just call me. I can't believe what the NSF did to your family. Enough of that, soldier. Whoops. We each have our troubles. I lost my children, but you've had to grow up without your parents, which requires more courage. I don't think it matters. My parents died in a car accident. That's different. I said that's enough. You have your own op and time is short. How about I issue you a stealth pistol? That sounds fine. Thank you, sir. What else do you think you'll need? Smart lockpick, nanotech multi-tool. Yeah. Can you spare a nanotech tech tool? A man who uses his head. I like that. Now move out. Manderley's waiting. Hey, what about that guy out front selling munitions? Is that allowed? Oh, Captain, right. We've got some screwballs around here, but he's not the problem. It's whoever's been breaking into the armor. Someone at UNACO's a thief? Yes, sir. And a damn good one. <laughs> Gotta hand it to him. I don't remember if there's a way in there or not. Alright, back to Manderley's office. I don't like getting shot at. Not one bit. Not one bit. Wait, wasn't there a way to level four? I thought there was. Maybe not. Troubles. That will be JC's job. What's that? Power station. The NSF have Ambrosia in a warehouse protected by cameras and booby traps. <laughs> we want to power down the whole system. We're taking one illicit generating plant, protected by weak groups of NSF. Knock out that plant, and Paul's team can walk right into the warehouse. Just tell me where it is. The NSF are openly resisting our deployed forces, gradually falling back. You have to deal with them first. And you be ready, Paul. When the power drops, go in and go in hard. Mm -hmm. I'll use my discretion. Go in like the U.S. Marshals. We lose the vaccine, I'm sending your butt to the mayor to explain why he and his three daughters won't get their pills this month. 
Yes, sir. Let's not waste any time, JC. Get down to the dock. A boat is waiting to take you and your partner, Anna Navarro, to shore. Yes, get moving. Here's your op bonus for the great job you did in the statue. 1,000 credits. Nice. We take care of our people around here. <laughs> the bonus for rescuing Agent Herman goes to one of the troopers, though. I'm sure you understand. My bad. Thank you, sir. Go to the South Dock and take the police boat to Manhattan. Let's do it. Excuse me, boys. Didn't know the NSF had so many people in New York. We finally got to cap some rebels, eh, Denton? <laughs> Talking to the wrong guy. What is this? Oh, the retinal. All right, 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 right. Main entrance. Wish I was going with you. Yeah, I appreciate the sentiment, bro. You would just get me caught, though. All right, note to self. Do more exploring. Huh? South Dock, here I come. Yeah, it was right here the whole time. Seriously, like... Right at Unaco's doorstep. The boat's ready. Thanks. Just grab a little drill from my way for the ride. Let's, get out. Let's do it. Bro, chill. 